Ooh, my hair, my hair, my hair. Anyways, hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Hope everyone is doing well. I'm excited because today I have a small Sephora haul. I've been um, getting these products and saving them to show you guys what I've been interested in purchasing lately. They are not new on the market. They are new to me, but I've always wanted this product. So now that I have them, I want to share them with you. So if you're new to my channel, please consider subscribing. You mean the world to me. And let's get right into the video. I'm excited. I'm so excited. Here is the box. There's not many things in here, but the things I have in here, they're all some of my favorites and they were have been on my wish list for a while. So let's get into the first product, what I'm going to grab here. And this is the... Oh, before we get into this video, if you guys are interested in this look, I probably am going to post this look before this haul so you guys can see it. It's the ColourPop Hello Kitty uh, collection. So that's what I'm wearing on my face and... Yeah, if you like it, you can feel free to check out that video. Um, so now let's get into the haul. So the first thing I picked up and I really want it, I don't know if you guys remember, but I did a video on the Kaja Bento trios and I bought the more neutral warm shades and now I went ahead and I bought the Kaja Bento trio and this is in the shade Alota Colada. And you can see that the shades are right here on the box. So those are the shades that are inside. Now let's open it up. Ah, I love this trio. It's like ah, so cute and adorable. The other one that I have is the brown one. This is the brown one, the more neutral one. But I wanted to have this one. I know there's another brown one in here. But I love this shades. I thought that this nice yellow shades and the pineapple at the top, the design looked so cute. Okay, so let's open them up. It comes with a mirror and there's the first shade right there. So beautiful. Let's go into the second shade. Oh, it's a shimmery one. Look at that. I will do some swatches for you guys too. And here is the brown one. That's such a beautiful warm brown. I love it. So the first one is this nice ooh, yellow. Second is that nice shimmer. I love that shimmer. Isn't that beautiful? And the last one is the beautiful nice chocolate brown. Look at all those shades. Those are so pretty. Let's see how they swatch here. One, two three right there on the hand this is this first one right here you can create such a beautiful eye look with this you can use the yellow one as transition the dark one in the outer corner and the shimmer in kind of half of the lid towards the inner corner it's just beautiful okay now speaking of kaja let's get the other one because i picked up another one and this is the glowing guava kaja bento trio I just love these trios. I think they're so cute to have them in your purse or have them in your makeup bag. It's just uh, beautiful to travel if you do travel anywhere. And this is what this one looks like. Look at that. And the colors are this ones that I picked. I wanted something pink and purpley. So let's go ahead and open them up. Of course, the first one is more of a brown mauve shade. The second one, oh, there's, oh my God, look at this shimmer. It's a nice shimmery shade. Do you guys see that? And the last one is a nice, um, more of a reddish brown with a shift or a shift of pink. But let's see how they look on the hand. I'm going to, I'm going to swatch them for you guys. Okay, so here's the first one. Very hard to see on the finger, very similar to the skin color. Then here's the shimmery one. Oh my gosh, this is such a beautiful shimmer. I would have thought that they're more pink, but you know what? I'm not mad because I like the shades. And this is the darkest one. They are gorgeous. Look at this. 
beautiful and I still have them on my finger. They're so, so pretty. I love them. You can create such a beautiful look with this. Again, use this as transition because it's lighter. Use that as uh, the outer corner because it's darker or all over the eyelid. And there's your beautiful shimmer right there. I think these are pretty. So I'm happy I have this in my collection. I have yellows, pinks and purples. And of course I have the brown. This is what they look like. Yes, excited. So, speaking of trios, I saw this at Sephora and I got really excited. I've been, I've been contemplating if I should get it or not, but I'm, I have an obsession with trios and with stackable um, eyeshadows. So I bought the, look at this beautiful, the Melt Cosmetics I think this is not a trio. I think it says the Shape Shift Stack Eyeshadow. And I'll show you how cool this is. Look at the packaging. And so mine is in the shade, the Shape Shift Stack Eyeshadow. But this is what it looks like. Oh, huge. So let me compare it to you guys to the Kaja trios. Okay? Look how big this is compared to this one. It says, of course, Melt Cosmetics. I mean, just Melt on the top. And look at this. They're magnetic. So I'm going to pull the top one. Ugh, it's hard to pull. There's a mirror. The first one comes with a mirror. And here's the first shade. Then look. Then I'll take this one off. You can see. There's the next shade. Then I'll take this one off. There's another shade. And then I'll take the last one off and there's another shade. So very strong, oops, wrong way. Magnetic shades, no, the right way. Very strong magnet. So this is what it looks like. It's beautiful. So the first shade that we have here, it says on the back, it's called Delirium. Yeah, Delirium. And it's this beautiful shimmery brown shade shade with a shift of pink so this is a duochrome shade so pretty it's right here actually <laughs> so this is what this one looks like it's right here on the hand it's so pretty and this keep in mind they're all shimmers so I'm just gonna connect it back with the mirror and on the back it says the shade the next shade is the mimic shade and this is this purpley one you see if I move it to the, the kind of purple blue so let's swatch this one. Oh my god look at this you see it's like blue on the finger but it's purple in the pen <gasps> wow this is my favorite shade look at that purple blue I love it mimic shade Next one is the chameleon, which is, so it says chameleon on the back, and it's this beautiful green. Oh, this is such a beautiful shade all over the eyelid. I love this. So it's right here. Look at that green. It's so pretty. So let's swatch it. Beautiful green right here. Wow. Wow. Love, love this uh, tree, the stackable eyeshadows. I'm obsessed with them. And this is the shape shift because it's probably it shifts, it changes color. So I don't know if it's you can see on camera. This is kind of like red right now. And as I turn it, it's kind of like a green. So pretty. You see that shift? Let's try it on the hand. <gasps> Ooh. You see that? It has kind of like a green shift in there and red in there. So pretty. Now let's try it on the hand right there. Oh yeah, right here. So it's the last one right here. You can see the shift. Now these are all the shades. So it comes with four and a mirror at the top. And this is what it looks like. So definitely recommend the stackable eyeshadows. Now let's clean them up. And they do come off very nicely. So... It does not stain your hand. It's all off. Let's go to the next one. Now, the next one is, and I want to do a full review on this because I'm obsessed with bronzers. I did not need any more bronzers. And of course, I had to buy this. This is by this company called Say. 
I think that's how you say it, S-A-I-E, say. And this is the bronzer in the shade, it's a medium bronze right here. And it says Sun Melt Natural Cream Bronzer. So I'm going to do a full review on this and show you how it looks on my face. It's a cream bronzer. So this is what the bronzer looks like. So pretty. And this is the back. Let's open it up. Ooh. I'm not going to swatch it now because this is going to be a full review on this. There's quite a bit of product in here. It doesn't have any smell at all or anything, but look at this beauty. And I'm going to compare this bronzer to some of my other bronzer. It's a cream bronzer and I can't wait to apply it to the face. So yeah, this is another product I really wanted to have in my collection. Oh, so beautiful, right? And now let's get into... The um, Fenty Beauty. I bought the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Hydrating Longwear Foundation. Now I bought the hydrating one because I have more drier skin and I got mine in the shade 150. Let's hope it's a good shade. This is what it looks like. I have a Fenty Beauty one. Let me get it here to show it to you. Yes, I have this one, which is in the shade 100, and you can see it's quite light. So I went for 150. I really love this foundation, but because it's so light, I never got to use it that much. So I got a darker shade, so I'm excited. I'm going to be using this more, and if that's too dark, I guess I'll combine them. Okay, and another thing that I would like to do a full review on is the Kosas Brow Pop product it's a pencil for your brows and mine is in the shade medium brown and i just love the packaging like look at this it's so pretty nice pink matches my shirt it comes with a brush on one end and the pencil on the other so this is another thing i got in this haul because i want to review it for you guys so I'm excited, stay tuned for those reviews. And of course, I bought the Pat McGrath, and this is the Eye Ecstasy um, Eyeshadow Palette. Well, not really palette, because there's like a couple shades in here. Subversive Eyeshadow Palette, I guess. So let's open it up so I can show you guys. I love Pat McGrath um, Eyeshadow Palettes so much, and this one, attracted me because, let me get rid of those things inside, because it comes with, this is what the uh, palette looks like, it comes with five shades and they are so pretty, like look at this, those are those shimmery shades. So I wanted to have some of her shimmers in just one palette. Now, of course, the packaging is more, it's plastic. It's not high-end looking, kind of like her regular ones. And on the back, it's kind of a sticker with um, the shades. So it's not very high-end looking, but I wanted to try out her shades. So let's go into this blue right here, this brown, the gold. And like, see, oh, see, this is what I'm talking about right there. Look, just swatches. Amazing, amazing. And then let's go into the purple one and the other more brownish red. Oh, I don't want to touch them. They're so pretty. That's what they look like. So let's do the purple one and then the brown red at the bottom. So here's the brown red and here's the purple one. Like, look at those shades. Like, you cannot go wrong with the shades. So I got this too. It's so nice to have this in my collection. So easy to carry. I'm just so excited with all of this. Oh my gosh, look at those. Aren't those pretty? Anyways, and of course the haul came with a Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Push-Up Lashes Mascara. This is what it looks like. It's a nice mini mascara. I would love to try it and I, I really love it. I'm going to purchase the bigger version. That was my mini haul from Sephora. I was so excited to share all of this with you guys because um, I'm just obsessed. Like, look at this. 
I'm just obsessed with all of this stackable eyeshadows. I don't know what's what's with me, but I'm just, I don't know. They're just beautiful. So please make sure you comment down below and let me know what your favorite product was in this haul or if there's something that you want to add to your list to buy in the future. I would love to hear that. And yeah, if you're new to my channel and you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing and give this video a big thumbs up. It will mean the world to me and I will see you in my next one. Love you guys. Bye.